Hey everybody, here it is Tuesday night, uh, 6 o'clock. Um, was out here last night. I don't know how long, but it was more than an hour. Got the fan in the wall. Um, I haven't got it wired yet. I just got the BX cable. I'm going to put that on there. I just drilled a hole in through the wall there. I put a new switch on it. And just going to run it up the wall and plug it in right there. Put the switch on the top of the box there. So that should work out all right. So um, I would have finished this last night, Monday night, but. Uh, but he came down and tried the welder. There's nothing wrong with that welder. Uh, he had that baby just to singing. And my problem was I didn't have the wire speed fast enough. I just left it right where he had it adjusted. Um, and man, it sounds great. It just welds great. He, he just loved it. Um, he said I had the gas too high, he reset the gas for me. Uh, like I said, I just leaving it right where he left it because it works good. Uh, I finished my uh, little jigger tool there. Um, even my welds I feel look better. Um, a little globby, but this is matter, this is just the tool. Uh, backed up here that's a little fender tool that picked up the tip off of my little scratch and I trimmed her down a little put it in there like so and yank if you need to yank so I'm gonna call this tool because I have no idea what it's called I'm gonna call it MD Milo's tool. So that's what I'm going to call that tool. So I'm going to be using that a lot. So put some yellow tape around it just so I can find it because I have a hard time finding things. <coughs> okay. Also, last night I got this rain rail cut out. Uh, got the rest of the seam sealer down on the inside of that groove, I don't know if you can see it, but this is what I got left to work with. So, get around here. I uh, use tape to get a pattern, like so. Put that on my steel here and cut it out. And this is what I come up with. Uh, this slides up in there. See if I can do this. Just a minute, I turn the camera around here. Set her down until I get it in place. I don't know if you got if I got that set in the right place, but I just want to give you a shot here. All I got left to do here, whoops, backwards, is clean it up and weld it in. And hopefully. I can get that welder to work like Kevin did last night. So, anyways, I'll give you a rough idea what it's going to look like. I think it's going to be okay. Uh, that will push in there like so. Um, where are we? Oh, there we are. Uh, there's a little clip that goes in that square hole and those are holes I punched in there for the spot welds and it goes up to there and hopefully this will be okay and let's get a shot from the other side not too worried about being too neat on this side uh, uh, as you can see, fits in there nicely. I don't know if I get the camera in the right place. 
I'll have to clamp that. But first, first of all, I gotta fix the stop at. It stops right. Oh. There, right there. And I can weld that up in there. And down along there, I'll spot it once I get the other side all welded. But that's the best I can come up with there. So hopefully that's okay. Like I said, it's got to be seam sealed, so that ought to be work out all right. Ah, uh, yeah. Anti wand whacker pliers. Got a pair of them too. They're only ten bucks. I just didn't want to get in the habit of whacking the wand, like Thomas Hugh said, because it does it does make them mobile, and you need that pliers handy anyway to cut that little nib off every time. So uh, I picked up a set. They're not a brand name or nothing. They're just. Uh, liquid air or something. Anyway, I was so, I was so happy to know that that welder works okay. It was it was bothering me because I, I thought there was something wrong with it, but it was just me. That's all it was. Uh, I need a lot more practice. And slow SRT. You didn't give up on me, did you, man? Well, any time I was adjusting fenders, there was always the top bolts, the bottom bolts, and a bolt just inside the fender. Well, this one didn't have any. And I just, just looked really, just just in there. I didn't see no bolt. Anyway, I think I get a light. I I find the light here. Give me one up here. All charged up. Hope. Ah. Well, maybe it's not. It's not that, that one. Just a minute, I'll get a light. I gotta thank you for man for your uh You knew I missed that, didn't you? I know you did. Ah, let me see. If I can get a shot of this and hold the camera at the same time, there is a bolt way in there that I didn't see it and the last time you commented there I just got up off the chair I got my glasses for sure and I don't know if you can see that bolt or not but it's in there probably six eight inches six inches anyways and it's up towards the top and I was looking down that way so I thank you man for Thank you for uh, putting that up there a couple times, actually. You knew I was missing that. I know you did. And uh, I, can't, I haven't done it yet because I can't shut that door because I got the molding half down around the door. So uh, maybe tomorrow night I'll come out and do the fenders. Because that would be done. So that uh, made it a heck of a lot easier. Uh, the fenders aren't welded at their factory. They're, somebody's welded them over the years. Um, it's, it, it's not pretty under there, but uh, I see there's not even a bolt in this end of it, so I don't know. Uh, we'll get the fenders lined up, and uh, again, thanks for uh, thanks for uh, not giving up on me there. Uh, as soon as I came over here and found that bolt, I said he knew I missed that bolt, so right on, man. So, anyways, I'm gonna weld that up. Get that welded in there and then come back and give you a shot. I forget what else I did, but it's been a very productive two nights and not done yet. Uh, my hours are turning into two and three, but it's worth it just getting these little things wrapped up. So I'll be back here in a few minutes to give you a shot of what's going on. So. Did I stop it? Okay, okay, I'm back. Um, it's 20 to 7. I got her tacked in. Um, it's not very pretty, but the seam seal will hold that. 
cover that up. So this side here, actually didn't. I gotta grind it some more. Um, actually looks pretty good. From what I had when I started it. So I'm gonna grind it some more. It's nice and solid, and see if I can get a bead down along here. So it looks neat, and in here, neaten it up, and it's body fill, because it's covered right from here in with this uh, molding that I didn't want to take down, uh, but I had to just get in this area. So uh, that's pretty much it for tonight. I'm going to go get shower and call it a day. Um, get some time in, get some little jobs done. That was a booger to get, Greg. But I think I got her. This chrome cap was over this, so I wasn't too worried about that. I got a little dent in there. Gotta try to get out. And it's gonna come up pretty easy. Yeah. Fixed. Anyways, uh, welders work working a lot better. I said it wasn't the welder, it was me. So, anyways, that's it for. Monday and Tuesday night power hours. I don't know if I'll get out here tomorrow night or not. Um, anyways, I'll be back at it Friday, bright and early. So, just want to give a little update. Try to get some of these little things done so I can get at this thing. Get her going. Uh, I'm not going to meet my deadline. That's for sure. Uh, Deadline was supposed to be this weekend, but that's not going to happen. It's over here in the light. So, I set another deadline. Second week of October. Yeah, October. Um, I get that other green channel fixed, get this one finished. Uh, we'll hold it back. And it's just going at it. I, uh, I don't have a mini DA, so I think I saw James Freddy as a mini DA, and I think I saw Tommy Shue cut one of these down. I think that's who I saw. Well, I thought I'd try it so I can get into the door jams a little easier, or take a little more of that out without wire and wheel on it if I don't have to, and all these little edges around the front. So actually, I tried it. It works okay. So we'll get that over a try. Just an old pad ahead, the edges all wore off, so glad I didn't throw it out. Gonna give that a try. Anyways, just a short little video. Uh, these power hours pay off. Uh, don't usually end up for an hour for me though. I get out here and get carried away, and next thing you know it's dirt, but tonight I'm gonna call her, call her now. That was an accomplishment. I didn't know whether I could get that in there like that, but it's in there. Now the other side, just a little small hole. It's gonna get a quickie. So. Anyways, thanks for watching the videos. Uh, thanks again, Soil SRT. Uh, I'm sure I'll get those fenders adjusted now. God, I can't believe I missed that bolt, but now I know they're there. Uh, thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Take it easy. Bye.